The armed forces of the Russian Federation continue the special military operation. The armed forces of the Russian Federation continue at launching attacks with high precision, long-range air-based armament at the military control and energy system facilities of Ukraine. All the assigned targets have been neutralized. Concentrated fire of Russian troops have resulted in frustrating the attempts made by units of the armed forces of Ukraine to cross the Zhorobets River near Nadia, Stelmakhovka, Makeyevka in Lugansk People's Republic, and Yampolovka in Donetsk People's Republic at Krasny Leman direction. The enemy has been driven back to initial positions by fire attacks launched by Russian artillery and dummy aviation. Over 40 Ukrainian personnel, two armored fighting vehicles, and three pickups have been eliminated. Up to three Ukrainian battalions, including one armored, attempted to break the defense of Russian troops towards Novaya Kamenka Chervoni Yar in Kherson region. The enemy succeeded in wedging into the defense of Russian units near Sukhanovo in Kherson region. Russian command involved armored reserve forces and organized ambush operation that caused considerable casualties among enemy units and made Ukrainian units to escape disorderly. The positions along the front line have been completely recovered. Over 200 Ukrainian personnel, 14 tanks, 16 armored fighting vehicles and 7 motor vehicles have been eliminated at the above-mentioned direction. Three tanks, one infantry fighting vehicle and UR-77 mine action system have been captured as trophies. 18 Ukrainian personnel have surrendered. Operational tactical and army aviation, missile troops and artillery have neutralized three Ukrainian command posts near Dvorechnoye, Lushkovka in Kharkov region, Lubimovka in Kherson region, as well as 72 artillery units at their firing positions, manpower and military equipment in 179 concentration areas. Moreover, five Ukrainian provisional bases have been destroyed near Kramatorsk, Seversk, Kirovsk in Donetsk People's Republic, Novaya Kamenka and Patikatki in Kherson region. Four munitions depots have been destroyed near Figalovka in Kharkov region, Artemovsk, Petrovskoye in Donetsk People's Republic, and Matveevka in Zaporozhye region. Fuel depots for Ukrainian military equipment have been destroyed near Ingulets in Dnepropetrovsk region. One U.S. manufactured ANTPQ-36 counter-battery warfare radar has been destroyed near Berhovka in Donetsk People's Republic. One ST-68UM low-altitude target detector has been destroyed near Nikonorovka in Donetsk People's Republic. Within the counter-battery warfare, one Olha MLRS battery has been neutralized near Lipci in Kharkov region. Air defense facilities have shut down one Mi-8 helicopter of Ukrainian Air Force near Terny in Donetsk People's Republic. Moreover, 18 Ukrainian unmanned aerial vehicles have been shut down near Vysokoye, Suhanovo, Sadok, Tomarino in Kherson region, Zelonigai, Skelki and Burchak in Zaporozhye region. Three projectiles launched by Olha MLRS have been intercepted near Novomikhailovka in Donetsk People's Republic. In total, 324 airplanes and 162 helicopters, 2,296 unmanned aerial vehicles, 383 air defense missile systems, 5,926 tanks and other armored combat vehicles, 874 combat vehicles equipped with MRLS. 3,511 field artillery cannons and motors, as well as 6,665 units of special military equipment have been destroyed during the special military operation.